Hey everybody, happy Sunday. It's me, Minu, back with another video. Um, wanted to thank everybody for like all the subscribers. I was gonna do a video, be like, oh, I have 500 subscribers, and then that just blew past, and it was like 600 subscribers, and it's like 650 at the time of recording. It might be higher later, but um, really happy about that. Really surprised because when, and I know a lot of you are from the the asexual discourse video, and honestly, when I made that video. I was not under the impression that anyone would even look at it because I was just like mad and like going off about some shit that, you know, I felt like people weren't listening to me about. So I was like, yeah, I'm going to talk about this. Um, so I wasn't really because like I I think it was like just this year that I was celebrating having 20 subscribers. So having much more subscribers is it's a lot. It's a lot. I'm happy for it. I appreciate it. I've been super happy to read all the comments and people's different opinions, whether you disagree with me or not. Um, uh, if I haven't responded to a comment in like 24 hours, it's probably because YouTube's been doing this thing where they've been like, I don't know what they're doing, but they're like making comments disappear and reappear days later. So it'll be like, I will get an email that someone commented, click to respond, and there will be no comment to respond to. And then like five days later, it's like, oh yeah, that's there. So sorry about that. If it took me a long time, I usually respond very quickly. I spent a lot of time the last couple of days responding to all the comments on the asexual discourse video. Um, just a couple notes about that. Some things that I saw come up a bit is, um, one, people were saying that this can be applied to the aromantic community. I agree. A lot of things that happen in the ace community can also be applied to the aromantic community. Um, two, somebody in the comments was trying to use this to compare to, um, I don't know, them not wanting trans women to be a part of the lesbian community or whatever. I don't think it's the same thing, but as a not as a non-trans and as a non-lesbian, I don't really think it's my place to speak on that. I want to speak on things that are about me um, or that I'm like related to in some way. So I, I, I can't speak on the experiences of lesbians or trans women at all. Now, I'd love the people who share your experience in the comments. People should listen to you. But there ain't nothing I really have to say about it because it's not my it's not my experience. Um, also, I'm standing because I'm struggling with some pain right now, and I don't want to exacerbate it by sitting. Um, so that I'm standing right now. Uh, another thing I want to point out: thank you to the people who are going back and watching other videos um, because that's really helpful. Not like just for the algorithm or whatever. Like I'm not trying to do this to make money or whatever, but I just feel like, especially like the ABCs of menu, really helps get a better understanding of like who I am as a person and where I come from and like what my experiences have been and how that shapes who I am today. So those of you who are doing that tells me that you're actually interested in knowing more about me. So I appreciate it. And um, another thing that I thought was important to mention, um, on one of my videos, well, a couple of my videos, people have been like talking about politics and stuff and the video I made about like black women mistreating each other, there was somebody who was like, oh, I've never had that experience. I've always had great experience with black women. Da, 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 da. And then I've also had in like one of my other videos, someone being like, I've only had great experiences as a black person. I've only had great experiences with white people and you are invalidating me or whatever. If my experience or my idea about something that I'm talking about does not resonate with you because your experience is different, that's fine <laughs> you know what i mean i i'm not out here to say that my experience is representative of a, of everybody i never say that i literally in my videos say that if you have a different opinion or you have a different experience talk about it in the comments i don't say um everybody should think the way i think because of this this is no i realize that i come from a very specific background I'm very specific with my identities, you know, with atheist, asexual, black woman in America, duh, 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 interested in this, 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 passionate about this, speaking this language. Like, I'm, I'm very specific to what I'm talking about. So if you don't have the same experience as me, please do not take it personally. 
Because some people in the comments are kind of taking things personally, like I'm saying that them specifically and their experience specifically don't count because it's different from mine. I would never say that. And even when I reply to their comments, I'm like, I'm glad you have good experiences with other black women. I'm glad you've had good experiences with white people. That's not what I'm talking about here. And feel free to make your own video about it and talk about your experience. And I will respect that video just like I respect people's experiences. I'm not ever trying to say that my experience trumps anyone else's experience. Like even if there was another black atheist asexual woman in America who speaks this language and has this background or is from the South and da 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 da, da and they have a different opinion or something for me, cool <laughs> i i don't care i i it's fine that people have different experiences and i think that um a lot of people could learn from like just taking a step back and like just thinking things through a little bit um because like and i don't know if i said this in my other videos but like one of the big things about me and the degree I got was all about learning about people with different experiences from me, different cultures, different religions, different ideas, different political viewpoints. Like that was like all I did in college. So I'm very much aware that people think differently from me and feel differently from me. And that's why in the videos I tell people to share their experiences because I know they're gonna be different. So, don't ever think that I'm saying that my experience is more important than someone else's. It's important to me. And when I make these videos, um, they're about me and my experience. Every video on this channel is about me and my experience. Or there might be an occasional situation where like, I have a friend who said that they had this experience. But even then, it's still connected to me. I, um, I don't necessarily go out and say because black women treated me wrong that all black women are bad and uh, da, 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 and we should have this type of legislation against black women or whatever. No, I just say like, hey, I've been treated wrong. I'm not happy about that. I'm gonna tell my truth. They might have a different opinion. They might have a different interpretation of how things went, but I'm gonna tell my truth on my channel because that's what I'm here for. This is for me. <laughs> um, uh, and I've even said, if you go back and watch older videos like that, I, I didn't see anybody ever like looking at them. Like, obviously I'm making them public. People can watch them. Um, and I'm fine with people watching them, but for the past year, no one's been watching them other than like my friends and a couple people who I don't know, but they've commented and I appreciate them, them, the, you know, the day ones, you know what I mean? Um, but it's not something that I ever thought that a bunch of people would be watching and looking at. And another thing that was funny with the asexual discourse video was that it actually got shared in one of the groups that I'm in myself. And I thought that was funny because in the past when I've tried to share my videos, um, the admins in the groups are always like, no, no self-promotions, da 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 And then someone else shares my video and, and then it gets like more views and stuff. I just think that's funny. Um, I think people should be able to share their videos. And I think there's one person who in one of my groups, they ended up on like, I think a TLC show or something to talk about like, um, I think it was like they were ace and kink and, but it, instead of focusing on the ace part, they focus more on the kink part, um, which TV shows tend to do. I know I'm rambling, okay, but I'm just I'm just talking about how I feel about all of the subscribers, all of the comments, all of the views, um, and this channel in particular. Because like I said, this channel is for me to tell my stories and to talk about things that I care about that are passionate, that I'm passionate about. I forgot to add an intro. <laughs> so if I if this if this shot looks different, that's that's why it is. But yeah, some other things that I want to talk about on this channel. I'm, I'm gonna want to talk more about trauma because I'm going through my own personal journey with that. Um, I'm gonna talk about family because holidays. I'm already feeling some type of way. Um, but the next video is gonna be about asexual dating. I'm kind of rambling in that one too because I'm just really frustrated. Um, so take it with a grain of salt. I said it while I was really frustrated. And you know, you guys are feel free to correct me in the comments and like share your experiences. But I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for the love, for the support. You know, some of you commented on my video just to feed the algorithm, which I thought was hilarious. Um, 
And so, like, I really, really appreciate all the work you guys put into, you know, like subscribing and engaging with the content and engaging with the videos and engaging with me. I really appreciate it. It makes me really happy. Um, even when we disagree, the fact that we get to talk to each other still makes me happy. So that's all I got to say. Thank you for the 600 or so subscribers. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye.